Hey peeps, it's me, Petra. Okay, so I'm just doing journaling tonight and um, <laughs> I just thought I'd do a quick video so you see what I'm doing. I've got my snacks and my coffee, or well, my mocha, it's like a Milo and coffee. <laughs> so I have, um, this is just one of my pages and I started like stuffing around with this little ink pad. Just making it a bit, um, I don't know. Just giving it some texture. Well, not texture, and colour. Because um, this is the other bits. And I've been inked that page a little bit. And I inked that one a little bit. And, yeah, just doing... Putting some stuff together, basically. And, yeah, inked that one, the other side of that page. And so, yeah, I'm using some Kayser Craft stamps. Cool there. Night. stuck on the rules paper and they're the stamps that I'm all using all oh, that one's on the page and this one's on the other page and I was gonna use this one too upside down of course on um, this page and so here's those other stamps I just used that one on that one um and I have um, this was just my practice sheet for that rose and yeah that's what I was doing my cover to my journal is under there drying at the moment I want it to go flat because it was kind of warping a bit because I put material on um, card yeah so I'm trying something different so yeah it's gonna be material cover and when that's completely dry I'm gonna sew around the edges um, so as you know I've just put this box on as I just said I put this box on top so it can dry flat because it was warping um, I just had to stop the camera set because my daughter came out she just gone to bed and um, so yeah that's basically what I'm doing tonight and I just wanted to let you know that um, so oh, okay so here we go this is a stamp master that I was using tonight and what happens is um, so you choose your stamp get this thingy flat here that's just a foam bit I do have a video of when I first opened this that I don't know about a year ago now maybe a little bit more and there's my youngest daughter coming through so don't mind about her she's only two <laughs> so um yeah so basically well are you okay she's trying to close the sliding door on herself She's going to probably go for my crackers in a minute, so I might have to stop. <laughs> Here, do you want a piece of my cheese? Here you go. Here you go. Take that. Good girl. You go eat your dinner. She didn't eat her um, dinner earlier on. I don't know why. We think she might not be feeling really well. Last night she had a bit of a bad night. Oh, she's taking my washing basket. Okay. <laughs> okay, so um, what you happen, this is a clear thingy here and I'll put a link to the uh, video oh I showed my stamp master uh, unboxing and all that so what you do is you take out your clear stamp and um, you put it um, so the um, uh, smooth side is facing upwards so that when you um, you put it where you want it on here and then you put this over and then the this bit will cap the, catch the stamp and then you move it back over but ha I have to say because right now I'm a bit distracted because Bobby's here <laughs> these little magnet things are meant to keep your um, page in place they're very very strong magnets ah, ah. <laughs> now she's trying to grab my page no you got bolognese fingers okay um here here you go here's some more cheese darling there you go okay all right, now she's going. So you put your stamp on there, and when it's you put it over, so it'll capture it. Okay, so I thought um, I'd just show you anyway. So there's my stamp, and it's like the um, flat side up, smooth side up. So what I do is you push this over here, and you, this captures the stamp. See, like that. And then your page is going to stay exactly where you want the stamp. And then you just um, ink it up. And it's going to be a bit hard with one hand. I wasn't really planning this video. I just thought, oh, 
I'll just get my camera out while, you know, I've got everything out tonight. Now this might not come out, um, this is a brand new stamp, so it might not come out the best first time I stamp it. Usually it takes about uh, three goes before it comes out the best. So, um, yeah. And this isn't the best quality ink anyway. This was just an ink from an ink set I got from Wish. That's why it's so little and it's non-name brand and all that. All right. So I might have to do it a couple of times to get the best result. So then you just lift it up and put it over and it goes where you want it. And just give it a little bit of a push and then you stick, get it up again. And see, they haven't come out very well. So I'm going to watch it. I actually like that. You probably can't see it very well, but I actually like that. But I'll put some more ink on there and I'll do it again. Because, um, yeah, it never comes out the best first go. So, <laughs> But this stamp would also be really good for a background. So if I wanted to, I could probably like line it up and do it all the way up the page. That would look nice. Yeah, I'm just exploring, doing whatever. So yeah, this is just a Wish stamp. So, I'm uh, not stamp, it's K's across stamp, but the ink is from Wish. So, uh, it's the first time I've used it. This stamp, I got it for Christmas. See, that's still a little bit light in the middle, but it came out a bit better. Um, my phone's having a hard time focusing at the moment. So what I need to do is I put some more ink in the middle bit. And see how we go. Da -da 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 -da. Okay. I'm done. Okay. Oh. Okay, it did come out a little bit better. See how darker that is now? I told you, a third time, and it's the best when you do it for the third time. So, yeah. I do have some... Um, hang on, let's just check this. Oh, oh. Oh. I kind of like that. That's how it's supposed to be. Oh, like that. That's really good. Seeing that's what the stamp looks like. And this is the bit of what it's supposed to look like. So see that's exactly how it's supposed to look like. So that's why it looks like little bits of the writing missing. Anyways, anyways, that I just thought I'd just do a quick video as I've said a few times. And so I'll go now and um yes. I do have I, I am on Instagram now. Um so I'll put a link down below for that as well. So you can follow me on Instagram and I do have a, a closed Facebook group. I only let a few, some people in because I like to scrapbook without fear of um, showing my kids faces and all that stuff on YouTube or videos and on, you know what I mean. And of course, when you scrapbook, you have your family's uh, <laughs> face isn't that all right i'm gonna go stop blabbing and i'll update you when i do end up finishing this channel all right bye